Bismillah. Grammar of Unit 8, page 66. Uh, we will talk about the present perfect here in this unit. Um, present perfect lakhasta in three points. Uh, number one, it talks about indefinite time, al waqt ghir muakkad aw ghir muhaddad. It's in the past, but it's not in it's not a definite time, and it's not important. ممكن يكون غير مهم مو بس إنه غير مؤكد أو غير محدد هو مو مهم عندي it's not important the time this is why it's not there يعني غير مذكور or it's uh, also it's uh, time something that happened from the past up to now يعني شيء حدث في الماضي وأثره لا زال إلى الآن or it still happened يعني ما نقدر نقول إنه خلاص uh, um, مثلا if you say I have traveled to Dubai أنا إلى الآن I have traveled يعني هذا الحدث ماشي معي إلى الآن أقدر أقول هذه الجملة في أي وقت من عمري I have traveled to Dubai okay so these three points are important عندنا affirmative negative and short questions كالعادة affirmative القاعدة عندي subject has or have مع verb three okay when do I use has and when do I use have has مع she و he و it have مع I و they و we و you so إذا عندي she بختار has عندي they بختار have she has written verb three here التصريف الثالث للفعل هذا هنا التصريف الثالث للفعل it goes verbs in uh, verb two verb three نفس الشيء عندنا regular و irregular الأفعال regular we add ed العادية أما ال irregular يتغير شكلها كاملا فيتغير لما تكون verb two ويتغير برضو لما تكون verb three so here عندي she has written a story هو الفعل write في الماضي يصير wrote التصريف الثالث يصير written she has written a story نفس الشيء they have traveled to Egypt هنا travel traveled traveled regular verb مجرد أنه we add ed to it now to make them negative what do I do I insert not after has or have إذن she has Written a story, تصير she hasn't written a story. They have traveled to Egypt, تصير they haven't traveled to Egypt. Has not, اختصارها hasn't. Have not, اختصارها haven't. Now, number three, اللي هي short questions أو اللي يسميها لكم في الكتاب ال yes no questions with short answers. What do we do? خلاص بس نعكس هذه مكان هذه. The subject مكان has و have. So we will start by has و have and then the subject. كل عادة has takes she. إذن has she. وممكن وغالبا I insert ever in the question. يعني في حياتك ever in your life. Has she ever written a story? Have they traveled to Egypt? Or have they ever traveled to Egypt? يعني وجودها أو عدم وجودها نفس الشيء. In the sentence. Yes, she has. No, she hasn't. Yes, they have. No, they haven't. هنا عندي فقرة اللي هي the abbreviations اختصارات. I have, she has, he has, you have, we have, and they have. What do we do? We take out the H and the A فيها كلها, and we put an apostrophe, and we complete the word. I have. It's your I've. She has, she's, وهكذا للباقي. Also, there's a point here. هذه معطيكي أمثلة هنا. For the verb three. في الثالث. Also, in page 83 in your book, في كتابكم page 83, عندك جدول في تصريفات ال base verb اللي هو verb one. بعدين verb two اللي هو في ال simple past. وبعدها verb three اللي هو التصريف الثالث اللي يجي دائما مع ال present perfect after has أو have. Number two عندنا ال present perfect versus simple past. هنا إيش الفرق بينهم؟ هنا مقولنا that here not indefinite time, not important time. Something happened in the past up to now. Here العكس هنا we have a specific time. عندي وقت محدد دائما يكون إما last كذا yesterday before now. المهم إنه عندي وقت في الماضي محدد. So the present perfect has to have. She has written a story. هذه جملتنا. She has written a story. If I want to insert last year, or yesterday, or last month, or أي شيء يدل على الماضي. Specific time. حددت وقت. What it becomes? She wrote. ما هو she has written? لا. She 
wrote a story. هنا they have traveled to Egypt. هنا حددت وقت last summer. خلاص I will take the verb three and uh, change it into verb two and we will take out have. Let's see. They traveled to Egypt last summer. يقول لك verb two عيدها مرة ثانية هذه قلتها في البداية. Verb two and verb three. Are either regular verbs or irregular verbs. Regular verbs we add ed. They travel, traveled, closed, closed, open, opened, and irregular verb. It changes its shape completely. You have the schedule on page eighty-three. Like right, wrote, written, see, saw, seen, eat, ate, eaten, and so on. Form, meaning, and function. It is a revision of the most important grammar rules that we have studied in. This uh, semester, and then our say a simple present, but then a present progressive, but then a present perfect, and then a simple past. Let's go to number one, a simple present, which is subject verb one. We can add the the frequency adjectives always, usually, sometimes. Uh, they talk here about routines. You go like our habits, a shia routine or habits. هي وشي وإت الفرب بدون إضافات إلا حرف الإس فقط يعني شي يوجولي واتشز طبعا يوجولي ممكن أحطها ممكن لا شي واتشز تي في they play football لو كانت هي أو شي أو إت تصير plays football every afternoon لاحظي إنه every afternoon at four هذه تعتبر روتين أو habit this is why عندي Simple Number present. Number two, and the present progressive. مجرد ما أشوف progressive, progressive means verb ing. يعني مستمر. Progressive something that is still happening at the moment. أو now. عندي he is reading. لأنه present حطيت is أو are أو am. أما لو كان past أحط was أو were. عندي uh, am مع I is مع he و she و it are مع they و you و we. He is reading a book now. You are listening to me at the moment. So, and the subject will be by the verb ing. The present perfect. هذه اللي توني شرحتها نفس القاعدة. Has or have. Verb three. I have watched a horror movie, and she has gone to a big park. Gone. Go. Went. Gone. التصريف الثالث. She مع has. I مع have. Okay. Simple past. برضو شرحتها هنا قبل شوية. Here, subject verb two. In this, we're going to regular, irregular, regular, ed, irregular. It's higher. She went to school yesterday. We played football two days ago. هنا عندي وقت محدد في present perfect indefinite time غير محدد. هذه قواعد ثاني متوسط كامل انتهينا منها. If you have any question, you can send it to me in the comments or in the direct messages. And I hope you do well in your exams.